Looks like you're running late. You know, Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. I guess his bar cat might have finally caught up with him. Not now. I'll, I'll stop by when I'm doing my rounds. What's up, that cat's not fair. You're late enough as it is. Aw, oh, man, you cut the ponytail. Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to Get find my partner. there, Freeman. I'm it's expecting those days, you to report this message. They were also having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hatchet suit. Gordo, what are you sundown. doing you still running around? Right What's happening? Cut it out. What's going on out there? Well, this scope was correct. Someone pull this fire alarm or something. Come on, Gordon. What are you trying to do? Give me the trouble. Turn on. Good morning, Dr. Freeman. I'm not smart. I'm just better than you. Morning, champ. Hello. Another day, another dollar. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Fat. <sighs> no toilet paper. Be a dear and fetch me a roll of toilet paper. Uh, hello? Hello? Could somebody get me some toilet Oh, thank heavens. I'm in dire need of some toilet paper. remaining photonic energy to ensure resonance control. What's up, Doc? Ready for another rousing Gordon. day? Freeman, in the middle of something here. Ah, Freeman. Ah, Gordon. There you are. Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. We've just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of a gamble, but we needed the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. Mm. They're waiting for you, Gordon, in the test chamber. Right. Come on, then. I'll walk you down.
Eli has been busy making last-minute preparations for the new experiment. Greetings, Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning finds you well. Gordon, good morning. I'm glad you're here. These last-minute changes, they're a bit strange to just... Oh, it's about to go critical. What in the blazes is going on with our equipment? Oh, it was never meant to do this in the first place. Oh. It's nothing we can't handle ourselves, Eli. Run along, Gordon. We'll be but a moment. By Becquerel's ghost! Radiation level is off the charts. Oh, there you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Oh, here he is. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, Gordon. Yes, yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And... Potentially the most unstable. Now, now, as long as we follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that. Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. I just don't... Gordon think doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now.